Hey y'all, what's up? Welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new, if you've never been here, welcome you guys. Make sure you're subscribed to my channel for more videos. Today's video is gonna be a little different. Um, I just felt like spare of the moment would be more genuine and it would be more relatable. Um, but I wanted to make this video just to encourage you and to motivate you not to give up on what you're doing. I know I look a mess and I wanted it to be in this moment where I shared how I felt because I know someone else is going through the same thing that I'm dealing with. Here recently, I've just been really picking myself up and picking up my self-motivation to get on a schedule and to really put my all into my content and to work harder than what I've been doing. And let me say it's been a struggle. I've been doing YouTube for at least over, it has to be over five years now because I started like my senior year and I graduated in 2014. So it's been over five years. I've been consistent for the last two years. and Before that, I was consistent for like the first two or three years of my YouTube career. And I feel like I still haven't just reached that point where I'm like, okay, like this is it. I'm on a roll. I have it you know, going for myself when it comes to my YouTube. And I'm still learning so much about YouTube, you guys. But I really had to slow down and remember why I started YouTube. And I'm gonna get emotional because it, I've realized that it's something that I've been doing for a long time and I still haven't seen the results that, you know, I would like to see. But you guys, like, all the frustrations and all of like the hard work that I've been putting into YouTube, it really, it really is worth it. Like all of the frustrations, it's worth it because I know for a fact, if I keep doing this, it's going to be better than what I imagine, you know? And I'm sharing this video today because I got up this morning and I was just so motivated to film and I had my idea and I was so ready. And once I started, you guys, and I have everything that I need to produce a bomb YouTube video. I have everything that I need to produce a great YouTube video. And I still just haven't got that video where I'm like, wow, this looks amazing. I know that my videos have gotten better and I know that they're gonna continue to get better. And it's like every time I upload a video, it's like, oh, this looks so much better than the last one. It looks so much better, but I still have not achieved that video where I'm just like absolutely like, yeah, this could go viral, you know? I love my videos. I don't take them for granted, and I have everything that I need to produce a great video, so I'm grateful that I'm able to, but I just still haven't had that moment, you know? So I'm getting up today, and I'm preparing myself to produce this content, and I start doing my content and the frustration just took over. It took over and I'm like, why is this not working? Why is what I'm doing not working? Why is it not looking how I want it to? I even had a friend come over to help me with my setup because I have like all of these lights and this bomb camera and the backdrops. And I'm like, why is it not working? And after I cried and got all of my frustration out, I just had to remember that Remember where you started and look at where you are now and to appreciate those moments and to also do this because you love to do it. Don't do it for the numbers. Don't do it for the, recogni uh, the recognition. Like, do it because you love to do it. And I also have to tell myself, like, Julissa, just calm down and breathe. This isn't urgent. It's not urgent. It's not something that has a deadline. It's something that you do because you have the freedom to do it and you love to do it. And no one is making you do this. So do it with ease. It should be something you love to do. It should be fun to do. And if you ever feel frustrated in the moment of doing something that you know you love to do, just take a break. Take a break. Stop what you're doing. And remember that it's not urgent. You know, and I just got so overwhelmed because I'm like almost done. I'm like on the last scene of my video and I just stopped. I didn't give up, but I, I knew to stop and breathe. 
because I wanted to produce great content and I wanted to spread my joy through this content. And I knew for a fact that I wouldn't be able to do that if I'm frustrated and flustered and, you know, just all in my head about it. You know, I just have to stop and say, okay, we're going to try again tomorrow. So this video is solely to remind you to not give up, but know when to take a break. Know that it's not urgent. Know that you're doing this because you love it. And if you keep that spirit of positivity and keep trying and keep going, it's going to work out for your good. I don't know where my YouTube career is going. I honestly don't. And it's like I see myself in this, you know, I see myself in this light when it comes to YouTube. And I haven't got there yet. And I'm not going to stop until I'm past where I see myself. I'm not going to stop. I've invested too much time. I've invested too much money. I've invested too much passion. I've invested a lot of love for what I do. And that's simply creating. And a platform or a machine or an algorithm is not going to stop my fire. It's not going to keep the fire inside of me low, you know. I challenge you to... Keep planning, keep making those challenges, keep making those, you know, um, to-do list for whatever you are doing. And on a day where it comes, where it's hard to just do it, where it's hard to start, it's hard to finish, try again, keep trying. Don't blow the fire out, don't give up. Pick it up and keep going, but breathe, slow down, and it's gonna all be okay. So I just wanted to get that off of my shoulders. I just wanted to encourage whoever is out there feeling the same way about what they're doing and they feel like they've been doing it for so long or they feel like it's just not working. Like, what is the issue? God is not going to put something on your heart every day. He's not going to give you this desire to do something every day that he knows makes you happy just for you to not succeed at it. It's gonna look so much different than how you actually see it. And it's gonna blow your mind when you see exactly how it's supposed to be. It's gonna be completely different than what you, what you imagine it to be. So just remember that it's not about your time, it's about God's timing and he's always on time. If he keeps giving you those ideas and he keeps giving you those inspiration daydreams and stuff keep leaning towards that and if there's a problem that you're facing try to maneuver around it there's always going to be problems in life so try to remove it around maneuver around whatever problem it may be and figure out a solution and keep going don't give up so that is my quick rant motivation video for you guys today like i was just in a funk about it and then I have to take a step back and just remember, like, Jaleesa, there's no rush. There's no time limit to doing what you love to do. That's the point of it all. You have the freedom to do it whenever, however you choose to. So why are you racing? Why are you racing? You're not racing anyone. You know, this is your own race. This is your own run. So just breathe, just breathe. And you will feel so much better when you take the pressure off of yourself and the things around you and everything else will flow perfectly. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It is very real, very raw as you can see. And it's very important that I share this side of me because I know for a fact someone else is feeling like this. So I hope this video encouraged you. I hope it helped you on anything that you're dealing with as well. And I hope to see you guys in my new video. Thank you guys so much for the support. I love you so much. And I will see you in my next one. Peace.